When access to assessment is adversely affected, schools may apply access arrangements and reasonable adjustments, otherwise known as ARA, so students can demonstrate what they have learned during their studies on the same basis as their peers. ARA can help students with long-term and chronic conditions such as vision impairment, intellectual disability, physical impairment, a specific learning disorder, attention deficit disorder, autism spectrum disorder or diabetes. Short-term conditions and temporary injuries such as a broken limb, a cold or mild concussion, mental health conditions such as anxiety and depression, illness and misadventure such as measles, flu or other unexpected events such as flooding or the loss of a loved one during the exam period. Decisions about ARA are based on a student's individual circumstances and the impact of those circumstances on their assessment. So ARA may be different for students with the same diagnosis, condition, circumstance or subject enrolment. Students should talk to their school about the likely impact of their circumstances on their assessment and the adjustments they might need. This could be different exam conditions, such as extra time, rest breaks, or a separate supervised room, different format papers, use of a computer and assistive technology such as screen reader, speech recognition, or magnification software, or rescheduling of internal assessment. Schools will discuss the student's circumstances with them and their parents or carers, confirm what documentation, if any, is required, and submit an ARA application to the QCAA on the student's behalf if needed.